and welcome to another Just Kane with your host Just Kane. So I'm back here, I'm back at the dining table. We haven't been at this dining table for a while have we? Well it's because I could get a fairly decent lighting here with, with the help of the new halo light. Hello, hello. And I love this halo light because we can change the saturation if I can ever find the remote thingy. Oh! So I've just ruined everything now. Ha ha ha. There it is, look. Me hate that one. Oh. I'm going to chip that bit. But we love the. But we love our halo light. I can't change that to this too far away. So, but we love the halo light. It gives us great lighting. So, uh, so thank you, halo light. So, what are we going to be doing today? Well, there's a place here on Nantwich Road which I've ate at quite often, um, and I happen to know the food's great. So, spoiler alert: the food's great. But watch anyway because. The footage inside the store, you'll never see this in any other sh in any other takeaway place. The place is called Chef Izzy, and it's on Nanswich Road. It's uh, it's been around for a long time, and she knows what she's doing. So, and I don't know why I've never done her before. I've done lots of other people, but never done she our Chef Izzy. I mean, why would I have not done Chef Izzy? I mean, crikey. I mean, you know, she's only one of my favourite Chinese rest takeaway places in crew. So, you know, I really ought to give her a lovely food review. So that's exactly what we are going to do today. We are going to head out that door. We're going to put on our coat. We're going to get out that door, and before I go, I want to have a serious chat with you all. Okay? I need you to go down there. You see, there's a little red button there. It's got subscribe written on it. Go and hit it for me. It's free. It's not going to charge you. Don't forget to turn your bell notifications on to all, so you never miss any of my content. And don't forget to give me a big fat like, and don't forget to leave a comment. Because all of those things matter to me. They really do. They matter. Because I want you to stay watching me. I want you to be with me forever. I love all of my subscribers and I want all of the people that come and discover my channel to just feel the love from me. Because in the future, in 2020, we have got some big things planned and you have to stay tuned. So if you want to stay tuned and you want to see all the amazing things that we've got coming in 2020, and believe me, we've got some things planned. Um, then you're going to need to want, you're going to need to press the subscribe button. So go on, do it now. You know it makes sense and I've seen you watching. I know you watch my content and I know you come back week after week. So why don't you do yourself a favour and not miss it? Go and hit the subscribe button. Do it for me, do it for crew, do it for yourself. So anyway, let's get right into this video. Let's go and get down to Chef Izzy's and let's get us some grub. So off we go. We're leaving the house. Just pulled the hand off. <laughs> No, no, no. Well, that was just slightly embarrassing. Now, it might go a bit dark here because there's not a lot of light down this street. But I just locked myself out. So, as I was saying, I literally had to go to the garage next door and climb through the lounge, <laughs> climb through my bedroom window. I mean, it's not something that I want to do. And again, I apologise for any noise you can hear. As you can see, we're in next door to a busy road and we've got buses going past. 
Um, I'm not going to film much because obviously it's very dark out here. So today, as you can see, as I said, we're going to be doing a place called Chef Izzy's here on Nanswich Road. Now it's a place I've come a lot, a lot of the times in the few, in the past, and I happen to know her food is amazing. Um, but I thought I've done, ever, I've done so many other places here in Crewe, but I've never actually done Chef Izzy's. And I thought, you know what? Let's give Chef Izzy's a, fo a food review, and not just for me. But when you come in, if you're really lucky. Her fabulously talented daughter, if I can ever get her in shot, will play you a little tune. Isn't she a talent? How long have you been playing the piano, sweetheart? About seven years. Seven years. <laughs> Do you hope to make it a career one day, music? Probably. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, you're incredibly talented. Oh, so you. let's get on with ordering. Now I've got ten pounds with me today. Yeah. What is the best thing for me to order? So you want like? I'm going to leave the recommendation to you. Uh, so luckily it's Wednesday tonight. Ooh. So we got some Wednesday special, only Ooh. three pounds. So it means like ten pounds. You can have to order three dishes. That's Wednesday only. So. Yeah, we'll have that. Yeah. yeah. Do they come with rice? Um, that in you got your job by rice. Yeah. But all the portion is like taste portion. Oh right. Can it be smaller, but still good enough? You've got a deal. Yeah. So you can you got your job by rice there. Yeah. So it means you got king pro, uh, prawn, chicken, and uh, roast pork. Oh, we'll have prawn. I yeah. like prawn. So so you have uh, that mix. Yeah. Yeah. And then, yeah, you just choose whatever I like, say, the beef in black bean sauce, chicken yeah. rolls, sweet sour sauce, chicken curry, yeah, chicken rolls, that's special for the starter, Ooh. Uh, crispy cheddar beef, like sweet chili sauce. So I trust free. you to choose them for me. <laughs> I trust you. Go on, choose for me. So, you want sauce yeah. or just dry? What um, do you like? You're more like sweet? Well, I like sweet. sweet. I don't like sweet and sour. You don't like sweet and sour? No, I don't like sweet and sour. There's just something off about sweet and sour. So, I always say something should be sweet or it should be sour. It shouldn't be both. But, you know, everybody's to their own taste. You know, you cannot determine yeah. what other people like, right. you know? The chicken roll, um, I highly recommend to you. Yeah. It's that special. Right. You can try that. But it's kind of sweet and sour you don't have to have that, but when you, with steep a little bit, I can yeah. do curry dip if you yeah. want. Yeah, do a curry dip with yeah, that. So that's yeah, see I'm trusting, I'm trusting the lovely owner that I've known for, ooh, how long have I known, how long have I lived around here yeah, now? Yeah, how long have you lived around here now? There we go. Hi. <laughs> About six years now, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Creek, yeah. Yeah, it has yeah. been. I've watched your little one grow. Oh, sleep. All right. So, do you want spicy? Oh, I love a, I love a good spice. Yeah, spice. Let me think. So you don't like sweet and sour at all? No, I'm not a big fan of sweet and sour, I've got to say. I do like sauteed chicken, though. I do like that. That's the starter? Yeah. So I do you like want that, that or you yeah. want chicken roll? Maybe... I'll have the chicken sautés, I chicken think, sauté. definitely. Yeah, that probably, yeah. So, and I have a one rice. You yeah. Have my rice. Definitely. I love your rice, it's dead good. I don't treat myself very often. Yeah, um, so, do you want beef in blah bean sauce? Oh, I love beef in blah bean sauce. It's yeah. one of my favourite Chinese dishes, that is. I order that whenever I'm whenever I have Chinese with my mom. So no chicken roll, just chicken satay skew. Yeah. yeah. Young chow fried rice. That uh, beef in blah bean. So yeah. Nice. Nine pound, yeah. Lovely. It's coming in the right time. You can only have... do that in like third week for that Wednesday. Now you've heard that everyone on Wednesdays she's always got a special up on a Wednesday. Yeah. Um, it's a taste portion for only three pound each. So it's perfect for a review. It's perfect for crew if you just want a little bit of a taste of something. So make sure you pop in. She has one of the biggest, and I say she has got one of the largest Chinese menus I've ever seen. I mean, there is just so much on here. 
And I know for a fact she cooks everything fresh. We know this. So it is one of the largest ones in I've ever seen. I mean, it's just humongous. And she's got look, this gorgeous little tree, this little child. And the beautifully talented daughter. Did you have to practice for many hours to get this good? Yeah, I'm not really good. You are. I'm sorry, views in the comments here. She says she's not very good. You know, let's big up the girl and show the girl some love because she is amazing. Amazing. <laughs> and it's always so nice when you come into an Indian restaurant and she's practicing. Um, a Chinese restaurant, India, where am I? Uh, into a Chinese restaurant and the young girl's practicing here and you know she's been practicing here I've lived around the area I don't say where I live um, for about six years and I've seen her practice and heard her practicing in this store in this spot for the last six years and her piano skills have got better and better with every passing year and it's absolute joy to hear her play <laughs> And you should never think that you're not good, because you are. I bet your mum must tell you all the time how talented you are. No, I'm trying to do better, I'm best. <laughs> <laughs> do you take part in competitions and no, things? No. Uh, you should, you should go on Britain's Got Talent. <laughs> oh, that's good. Views in the comments, she definitely is good, isn't she? She's definitely good. I'll leave you the name on the YouTube channel and you can everybody comment and let's see, let's tell her how good she really is. <laughs> oh. Hi, so we're back from Chef Izzy's and you see the footage in there. Here's my bag of goodies, it's huge. Um, so what do we have? We have of course we have prawn crackers we love a we love a prawn cracker and as i said we've got this from the taster menu and to say that these are tasters there's a lot of food so we got the uh, special fried rice with king prawns, king prawn fried rice. So we're gonna have a little bit of that on our plate there. Oh, that's a, no, that's the melon. That's the fried rice with the prawns and the chicken. Oh my God, it's so fresh. Sauce. And we got the chicken satay. Oh, and we have the beef in the black bean sauce. Love that. So what I've done is I've put a little bit of a sample on a plate. So, let's give this special fried rice a, a taste. Mm. 
The rice is just cooked. It's fluffy, it's fresh. Mm. And that's that unmistakable fried rice eh? texture. These, these prawns are so fresh and delicious. Mm. It's definitely the perfect. You can taste the Chinese spice in there. It's not overly spicy. You could pretty much eat this as a meal on, or on its own. But of course, we're not eating it as a meal on our own, are we? No, we are not. So, one of my favourite things in the world is beef in black bean sauce. Look how rich that looks. Oh, I am shook. Mm. You've got that hint of soy sauce. You've got that freshness. You've got the beef is literally melt in your mouth. But then we've also got these, I'm not 100% sure what these are called. They're like little corn on the cob things. I'm not quite sure what they're called. But they are gorgeous. And it's got peppers and onions. And it's, oh. And all together, absolutely gorgeous. Put it all together and it is sensational. Mm, mm, mm. And I know what you're saying, Kane, you're not using chopsticks. Well, do you know I'm not? Sue me, what are you gonna do? You don't like it, turn over. Bye. So next, we're coming on to the chicken sauté. Have you seen the size of this sauté? I mean, I thought these were going to be tiny little things. No, I was wrong. They are fucking huge. Sorry for swearing. Oh my God, I can't believe that. Oh. Oh, that is spicy. You've got this, you've got a real spicy kick to that. But it's not too much. Mm. But it's a growing, it's a growing spiciness. But wow. That's why I love Chef Izzy, she's great. Mm. My fault. Sorry, I can't say anything about that. It's too good. The chicken is fresh. The curry sauce on the outside has got a real kick to it. I mean, you can really taste that paprika and that chilli. Oh, you can taste that chilli. That's got a kick in the back of the throat, that has. But it's not overpowering when you first put it in your mouth. It kind of grows and warms. And I've got a very hungry cat looking at me right now. A Jasper do. But I'm sorry, Jasper. I am not sharing this. So. So, overall. My final thoughts on Chef Izzy. My overall, my final thoughts on Chef Izzy. It's a fabulous little place to eat. It's on Nanswich Road by the British Lion, which is why I know it so well. Um, it's an amazing little place to eat. The food in there is always really fresh, really tasty and really good. I personally know the owner in, and she is a doll. She is a lovely lady. 
and her daughter is one of the most talented pianists I've ever heard. And, you know, let's big her up in the comments, everybody. Let's let her know how talented she really is and what a joy it is to hear her playing as, we're by, as you're ordering food and waiting for Chinese. It's a joy. It's an experience like you wouldn't believe. I mean, that girl just gives chef hisses that touch of class. So, I hope you've all enjoyed this vlog as much as I enjoyed eating it. And remember what I always say, don't dream it, be it, life is yours to make. Don't forget to go down there and hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to go down there and smash the like button. And don't forget to leave a comment. And try and watch till the end, guys. Because it really helps me. The more of my channel you watch, the bigger I'm going to get on YouTube. And of course you want me to get big, you don't want me to, you don't want me working a 9 to 5 job forever, do you? No. So, and I promise I will still, I will continue to get my channel better and better. I know I'm still learning at the moment and I know I'm still young and my videos are a little naive, but I hope as you're watching them i hope they're getting better and better and i hope you're enjoying them more and more so from me to you i love you all very much peace out don't dream it follow me on instagram follow me on twitter follow me on snapchat for god's sake follow me in the street actually don't do that because it's stalking and that's wrong unless you're really good looking and then stop and talk to me no i don't mean it <laughs> And don't forget to keep helping this channel grow. So I love you all. Bye now.